Hey, welcome back to Emily is Away 2. The sequel to Emily is Away. Prequel to Emily is Away 3. Which is out now. Uh, anyway, so yeah, last episode, we met Emily. We met Evelyn. Evelyn is into sort of punkier music. Uh, senses fail, rise against, against me. Uh, Emily is uh, more alt, uh, Arctic Monkeys, uh, Snow Patrol. So right now I kind of lean more towards Emily. Uh, anyway, Autumn 2006. So yes, whereas the original was like, you know, skipping ahead a year each time. This one, you know, starts summer 2006, autumn 2006, and now it's uh, moved by seasons. If there is no love in the world, we will make a new world. We will give it walls and a knocker that resonates so softly that we will never hear it. Jonathan Safran Four. Friday, October 13th. Ooh, Friday the 13th. Mysterious. Spooky. Uh, October 2006. Uh, again, so uh, there's a lot that I don't know. No idea what that is. A boot. Uh, Black Parade. So yeah, that's My Chemical Romance. No idea. Amy Winehouse. Casino Royale, The Departed, Scrubs, The Wire, Call of Honor. Or, wait, isn't it Call of Duty and Medal of Honor? Did they just, like, combine the two? Not actually sure. Cheeseburger, the, that, back when that was the big meme. I assume some sort of meme. I don't know what it would be, though. Oh, by the way, this apparently is Taking Back Sunday. Somebody uh, in the comments to my previous video mentioned that this is Taking Back Sunday. And I speculate that this might be Life is a Highway, but that seems doubtful to me. Because that song... I mean, hell, that song came out when I was a kid. And I was a kid way earlier than 2006. So, yeah, still no idea what that is. And honestly, still no idea what that is. Not sure what that is either. I mean, I'm guessing, again, I'm guessing it's a meme, but I don't know what meme that is. I just don't remember. 17 years ago. It was a long time ago. It's 17 years ago. There's a lot I've forgotten. Anyway, I don't care about anything here. Literally nothing here that I enjoy. I did. I did always enjoy uh, cheeseburger memes back in the day. Uh, go Snow Patrol, I guess. Take my hand, not your fingers, through mine. We'll walk from this dark room for the last time. Ugh, I don't. I don't like any of these. I genuinely, I don't. Like, I don't. I don't like any of them. I never watched any of them. I arrived with clothing, U.S. dollars, and a jar of gypsy tears to protect me from AIDS. Best is yet to come, I guess. Swanky! Still searching. I won't be saved. What did you expect from me? Try to forget me and just move on. I don't have love left inside. So take what I left you for the pain and do your best to forget my name. 10,000 fists. J-Radio. Emily, 
my starlight. Uh, video this time is uh, Starlight by Muse. Uh, the video is no longer actually available on YouTube. The uh, the account that uh, posted it, the account like it, the account that uh, the link goes to, uh, has actually been terminated. So, yeah. That said, glaciers melting in the dead of night, and the super stars suck into the supermassive. I like that song. On the whole, Muse, I can sort of take or leave. But Supermassive Black Hole is a great song. I do love that song. Uh, Kells Bells, Hoodies, Bonfire, Happy Feet. Aw, Happy Feet. Hoodies, Bonfires, Cuddling, Ball. Senior Year Checklist. Go to prom, get my license. Hey, congratulations, Kel. Try something new. Pull an all-nighter. Yeah. Yeah, that happens whether you want it. That kind of happens whether you want to or not when you're in high school. Do something illegal. Good luck with that. Watch a shooting star. Matatat. Snakes on a plane. What's with these monkey fighting snakes on this Monday to Friday plane? And boom goes the dynamite. It's a good line. Uh, this goes to the Crazy Frog Bros video. I don't know that I ever actually watched that one, to be honest. I have no memory of that. Uh... Let's go with Hey Yo. And Emily. Hey! James, how are you? Look, I'm bored, lol. How are you? Hey, James, what's up? Nothing much, really. You? Ugh, same. Hey, do you know what today is? I'm not sure what the Leaf Erickson. I'm guessing that's some sort of meme? Apparently Leaf Erickson Day is October 9th, so... Uh, it's a Friday. Not too much. Got home from Kelly's a little while ago. Oh, that's cool. What do you two do? Well, close, lol, but it's actually... Yeah, it was... Uh, well, close, lol, but it's actually... Oh, shit, my mom's calling me. Be back in a bit. How's that for some suspense? What? You're just going to peace? Yeah, it was fun. She showed me this new site, the Facebook. Do you know it? Ugh, Facebook. Facebook was awful. Oh. Not sure what this what this uh, is, but I know this one. I haven't looked at their profiles yet. Warp Tour 2006. Uh, this goes to Senses Fail. Uh, from uh, the 2006 Warp Tour. I'm stuck in a coma, stuck in a never-ending sleep. Someday I will wake up and realize I made up everything. A-S-L-E-E-P How clever. Happy Halloween. A 
And yeah, this is Sea Rose. Jumping into puddles, completely soaked. My nose began to bleed, but I got up again. Soft breath, beating heart, as I whisper in your ear, I want to fucking tear you apart. I love, I used to love Sea Rose. Uh, I, like, I really loved Sea Rose back in the day. Uh, they're an Icelandic band. Most of their songs are sung in Icelandic, except for some that are sung in a made-up language that they came up with called Hopelandic. Uh, I think that's interesting. One of their albums is titled just Brackets. It's just like opening and closing brackets. Like that's just like that's that's the title. It's just an opening and broke uh, open and close bracket. Every single song is untitled, which is just hilarious to me. Anyway. Oh, yeah, I do. I have a profile. Do I? Since when? Yep. Punk forever is away. If I'm not back in an hour, avenge me. Oh, cool. I'm setting mine up now. There's just so many questions. Don't get any wrong. It'll ruin your senior year for sure. Don't think you can actually get to your uh, profile here. Aha! Uh -huh. oh, oh no! Okay, last part. I have to write a status? What should I write? Emily is the best! Aha! Uh -huh. That's definitely what I should use. There! It's finally done! Awesome! Send me a link! Don't make fun of it! Alright! So, yeah! Facebook! Emilyisaway.com slash Facebook. So, yeah. Emily is away version of Facebook. Again, the links on the side don't work. Email, aim screen name. Birthday is April 18th, 1989. Relationship status in a relationship. Uh, six stories. Plans to attend Relay for Life. Posted a video. YouTube, Snow Patrol, hands open. Kelly mentioned Emily in her note. I'm bored, so let's do this question thing. Emily and Jeff are now friends. Emily and Kelly are now friends. It even sends the friend request. And lets you poke. Oh yeah, actually, this actually works. You have poked Emily. Emily is, quote, pretty alright, end quote. Oh, you can look at their uh, profiles as well. Uh, six groups. True Life, Indie Rock, I Have Seen Uritis, NYC, You Go Glen Coco, Music for Polar Bears. Uh, interests, art, New York City, poetry, being unnecessary and excessive. Favorite music, Snow Patrol, Cigar Rose, hell yeah. Arctic Monkeys, Manchester Orchestra, Death Cab for Cutie, She Wants Revenge, Arcade Fire. Aside from Cigar Rose, no one there that I particularly enjoy. I did really like Arcade Fire when they first came out, but I got tired of them. I find them, I did end up just finding them just pretentious. I mean, they came, when they when they came out, I was going through a bit of a pretentious phase. I sort of stopped, mostly stopped with it. 
uh, favorite movies: Departed, Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind, Fight Club, good movie, Prestige. Favorite TV shows: That '70s Show, good one, Scrubs. Favorite books: The History of Love, The Sledding Hill, Go Ask Alice. And favorite quotes: For whatever we lose, like a you or a me, it's always ourselves we find in the sea. And yet, yeah. Kelly told me to do this. <sighs> this will take a while. What made you start liking the person you like right now? He's just really nice. Fess up, who was the last person you thought about kissing? Jeff was. What brings out the worst in you? Liars or fake people? Do you believe in 1111? In what, that it exists? If you were in the hospital on life support, would your ex come see you? I don't know, I guess. Have you seen the last person you were talking on the phone with naked? Kelly? Probably, haha. <laughs> Is there anybody you wish you could be spending time with right now? Yeah, of course. Do you find smoking attractive? No way. Agreed. Think of the last person who hurt you. Do you forgive them? I don't know. Have you ever slept on a couch with someone? Yeah, sleepovers. Are you afraid of falling in love? Of course not. When's the next time you'll see your closest friend? Right now, I guess, haha. Who do you trust 100%? My friends. How many dogs do you have? Zero. I wish I had one. Boo, dogs. I don't like dogs. Want someone or something you can't have? Yeah. I mean, that's just human nature. Are you stubborn? I guess I can be. Have you had a friend for many years, and then they left just like that? Sure. Last thing you did before bed last night. Just talk to people online. Who was the last person you rode in a car with? I don't know. Probably Kelly. Do you have any friends you have never gotten into an argument with? Yeah, of course. Did you get the last person you texted a present for their birthday? I did. Would you be able to live without the last person you fought with? I don't really fight with people. Do you have any friends who, who never shut up about, about their boyfriend-girlfriend? Yeah, everyone does that. Did you have any unread texts when you woke up today? Yeah, haha. I fall asleep on people all the time. Does the last person whose house you were at like anyone? Me. Kelly, do you like anyone? Kelly. You know I do! Have you ever watched someone being carried into an ambulance? Not in person. I have... What time did you wake up last Saturday? Why? I don't know, probably just whenever. For me, 5 p.m. Get ready for work. Do you have a common first name? Yeah, it's okay though. Do you want to fix things with anyone? Sure thing. Do you like tech calling or texting better? Texting, probably. We millennials don't like phone calls. We don't do phone calls. Yeah, like... We're just confused and frightened anytime someone tries to call us. If you could go back in time and change one thing, what would it be? Doing this survey. Burn! You're going on a walk at night. Who's the first person you call to come along? Your. Who do you have texts from in your phone? A bunch of different people. Honestly, whose numbers do you have memorized? Uh, my house, parents, Kelly's, there are others. I have my mom's phone number memorized, and that's all. Actually, no. But is also a restaurant whose phone number I have memorized. Called it way too often back in the day. So I cannot I will always remember it. What is your mom saved as in your phone? Mom. Does it bother you when someone lies to you? Well no shit. Was it a boy or a girl to text you first today? A boy. Think back to this time last year. Were you happy? Yeah, I was. Why do you hate the person you hate the most? I don't really hate too many people. Do you think you're wasting time on the person you like? Nope, that's why I like them. 
Do you really, truly miss someone right now? Sure I do. Do you know anyone who would just drop everything to come see you? Yeah, a few people. Kelly's like two feet away, so does she qualify? Let's poke Kelly. Uh, her birthday is June. Step up 2006 trailer. Kelly is... Mutual friends, Matt and Emily. Uh, six groups. MTV, I have seen Uratus, Summer 11, Beaches, Shirtless Channing Tatum, Live, Laugh, Love. Uh, interest, Summer, Beach, Pool Parties, Prom, Anything Pink. Uh, music, High School Musical, Coldplay, Daniel Powder, Justin Timberlake, Nelly Furtado, Hannah Montana, Taylor Swift, Beyonce, Mio. I like none of those. Favorite movies, Step Up, Cars, Happy Feet, Break Up, Ice Age, Anything with Channing Tatum. TV shows, Hannah Montana, Drake and Josh, Degrassi, books, Harry Potter. You know what this means, right? You're going to have to get some tights. <laughs> Welcome to Mr. Bradford's website. Don't believe everything you read on the internet. Abraham Lincoln. It's no BFD. Goes to the actual Urban Dictionary. It's just history. As always with my class, as long as you get the work done and pass the tests, you will be fine. Morning classes are allowed to bring in eggs and bacon. Remember, you are not allowed to skip lunch period and get food from somewhere. Yes, you are, as long as you get me some. Uh, I'm looking forward to having a great year with you all. Well, shame. Wait, approximately doesn't mean exactly? What language do people from England speak? Isn't Australia a dictatorship because it's surrounded by water? Uh, what? Paula Abdul, opposites attract. Uh, what me and my sister wants to know is, does anyone know what Paula's background is? I mean, where her parent, I mean, where her parents is from? My sis says she's half Spanish, but I don't think so. Good question. As I recall, Wikipedia was a thing at this time, but it wasn't uh, as big as it would uh, become. So, understandable that people might not uh, think of it right away. Uh, and she's actually Jewish. Uh, her father is uh, Syrian Jewish heritage, and uh, her mother, uh, concert pianist of Jewish heritage, from Manitoba. So she is not Spanish. Uh, she is, uh, it's her Syrian heritage that would be making people think that. Uh, October plans to attend midnight meetup for alternate reality game gamers. Uh, LCD sound system. Daft Punk is playing at my house. Oh, this is kind of fun looking at this stuff. Uh, just RPGs, Internet, 4chan, YouTube, Samuel Jackson, LCD Sound System, Joy Division, Death From Above 1979, Pendulum, Death Punk, Ratatat, Prodigy, Boys Noise, Samuel Jackson, Shaun of the Dead, great movie, Memento, good movie, Spirit Away, amazing movie, Spirit Away is my favorite movie of all time, 
so good. Snakes on a Plane, Samuel Jackson. Sopranos, Firefly, Samuel Jackson. Your book, Samuel Jackson, an autobiographical memoir. And the monkey. Monkey fighting snakes again. Uh, groups. People of the internet. Techno, RPG gamers. GIFs, not GIFs. It's GIFs. That's what the that's what the guy who created them called them. They're GIFs. YTMND, Samuel Jackson. Newgrounds, the problem of the future. And yes, this is the, uh, this is, like I said, fake version of uh, Newgrounds. Links, I believe, yeah, the links go to uh, live websites. I can't think of it. I don't think I. See so, yeah. it. Here's Hefe. Mention Jeff in a note. In a note, I'm bored, so let's do this question thing. Uh, Muse, Knights of Sidonia. Cool, cool. I have no idea what this is. May 23rd birthday. Steam. Wow. Call of Duty 2, Dark Messiah, Might and Magic. Gary's Mod. Again, they go to the live version of Steam. Uplink, Psychonauts. Man, I kind of forgot that Steam is that old. I don't know that I was aware of... I wasn't even aware of Steam back then, honestly. Yeah, I don't like. I don't think I learned about Steam for a good few year, good few year more, good few more years after this. Uh, Muse, Knights of Sidonia. Obviously, I'm not going to get bothered with that. Uh, art, music, playing music, learning music, other stuff. Muse, The National, good band. Mogwai, good band. White Stripes, great. Shins. Uh, there's a couple Shin songs that I like, but generally not very good. Actually, Snow Patrol. She wants revenge. Manchester Orchestra. Right, so I can see why he and Emily get along, actually. They've got similar taste in music. Fight Club, Borat, D for Vendetta, Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind, Sopranos, That 70s Show, Great Gatsby, The History of Love. We learned them as we went, or got them straight away. The ones we left behind, the ones we sent away. That one, that sounds familiar. Um, there's something familiar about that line. Hmm. Can't really find anything about it though, so maybe I'm wrong. Uh, 
Uh, real rock, indie rock, I have seen Uratus, guitar, radio head heads, bass players. And finally, Evelyn. Although I think we'll be seeing hers later, so I think I will... I believe we'll be getting back to her later, so I'm going to put her aside for now. Oh, I'm going to poke you so much. I think she actually sends... Uh, I think... Uh, probably Evelyn sends a link as well. Ah, the poke war is on. You should send me a friend request when you get the chips. I already did. If you're lucky. So what are you up to tonight? Just going to stay in. Probably stay up late. If seeing is believing, then believe that we have lost our eyes. Don't worry, I'm still here. Just wanted to show off your away message. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's definitely it. I just don't want to talk to some people. Did you notice she went away? Set herself as away right before her boyfriend came on. Oh no, do I have to beat someone up? No, haha. <laughs> just, just kind of being an ass. Well, what happened? And bear in mind, just because you're friends doesn't mean that I'll automatically side with you. Just some bullshit, I don't know. Maybe I'm being bitchy tonight or something? I mean, you seem fine. What do you say? I can send you the chat log. Just don't show anyone, okay? Of course, I promise I won't. Transfer chat log to your file. Did you get it? Yeah, I did. So yeah, uh, so this actually does get sent to your uh, desktop. You get a desktop icon, which opens up this. Uh, I am history with uh, buddy J Radio Forty Nine. Uh, Emmers and J Radio. Hey Emily. Hey, what's up? And M, you? Nothing much. So when are you coming over? I don't know if I can tonight. I have a lot of homework to do. You can just do it here. It's like project kind of stuff. I really don't think I can come. Oh, come on. We've had this plan all week. I know, I'm sorry. Are you really not going to come over? I had a whole night planned for us. I don't think I can. Holy shit, are you serious? WTF, Emily. Yeah, Jeff's an asshole. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I told you that it might not work out. I didn't think you were fucking serious. Well, I was. I really can't believe you. I think I'm going to go. Sure, whatever. So yeah, he is, uh... An asshole. Screw that dude. I don't know, do you think I was out of line? Oh, absolutely not. Definitely not. You should be able to do whatever you want. Yeah, I mean, like, I don't think I'm going to be able to come over tonight. Yep. Sucks, but it happens. The way that dude just blew up on her? Yeah, he's definitely in the wrong on this one. Yeah, I just don't want to go over tonight. 
this is just hard being there. Well, that's not a good sign. It's really not. Yeah, maybe. Sometimes I just need a break. The problem's solved, though, because I can just fake being away and talk to you. Yeah. Just know that I'm always here for you. Thanks, James. Hey, random question. Do you remember my favorite games? I do. Because they're my favorite games. Oh yeah, role-playing games, right? Whoa, you remembered! I'm impressed! Oh, you should be. Do you remember mine? It's RPGs too! Of course I remember! Wow, you're pretty good! Hey, thanks! Hey, let's just end up some single rows together! Yeah! I know them! They're so good! They are! They're so good! Their music is just really pretty! Aren't they? I really love this album! Uh, talk. This shit touches me at the deepest level. Indeed. Like the music, just like the vocals. Perfect music for sleep. I will follow you. That sounds familiar. Death, oh, Death Cap for Gideon. I will follow you into the dark. Right. I was just curious what the rest of these were. Snow Patrol. Arcade Fire. There. Is this the Michael Jackson one? Ah, okay, yes, that's right. I remember that. Yeah, there was some prison that did a... Uh, this big thriller performance. Which, in retrospect, kind of weird. Anyway. Yeah, I love zeros. I'm not going to listen to the song, obviously. I'm sorry, I just realized I actually forgot to show the, uh, the video that I was actually talking about. Yeah, so the thriller, the uh, prison doing the thriller video. Also, side note. To listen to the song. I paused the video so I could listen to the song. It's a good song. This is great. Yay, let's listen to the album together. I have no idea what the what the lyrics mean, but their music always makes me feel so happy. For me, it's like sometimes happy, sometimes sad. Like it's like my absolute favorite of their songs is uh, "Untitled," but generally called "Vaca." Uh, gorgeous music video as well, by the way. Amazing music video, and that song just fills me with melancholy in a really like good way. Um, I think that's one of the songs that's sung in Hope Landing, so it's literal, so it's basically just gibberish. 
the lyrics like really don't mean anything. Uh, though it's also one of the only songs that does sound like they're saying something in English. I'm gen like I'm on I'll be honest. I'm actually not sure if they actually are saying something saying it in English. It really sounds like it, it really sounds like English lyrics. Though, give me one second. So apparently, that particular song was written in a mixture of Iceland Icelandic and English. Uh, the idea is that the people would find their own meaning to the song. Like I said, I always found it to be the melody is very melancholic. And I don't know, it's just what I hear in it, the lyrics that I hear when I listen to it, I don't know. Very pretty. Well, now we need to go to Iceland. All right, how about tomorrow? Hey, cool beans, you put Snow Patrol lyrics in your info. Thanks for showing me them. Hey, no problem. I'm glad you like them. You have some pretty good taste in music. So do you. So have you started applying to colleges? I've worked on some, but haven't sent any yet. Yeah, same here. Where were you looking to go ideally? Yeah... I went from college, or when I went from high school straight into the workforce. My job, my plan was to take a year or two to uh, save up some money. That became seven years, and uh, I didn't actually manage to save any money. I instead lived life and yeah, didn't really save any money. I was irresponsible. Anywhere that'll take me. You? I don't know. I'd really love to go to school in the city. Now, I've always thought it would be really cool to live in New York. Town so nice they named it twice. Oh, geez. I bet that'll be expensive. To be fair, everywhere is expensive. Depends on where you live. I think I really just want to get out of here and go someplace totally new, you know? I feel that. I feel the same. Do you want to stay in New York after college? Yeah, I don't like living in the city I live in. I want to get the hell out of this town. Yeah, I think they could be really grand. But I don't know, planning that far ahead can be a little silly. Yeah, so much could change. For example, you could find out that 
the uh, economy sucks and there's no jobs available in the field that you choose. And... Places that are hiring are not paying great wages and inflation means that everything is more expensive than it used to be. So you end up, I don't know, having to move back in with your mom while you work part-time at some shitty place. Just as a completely random hypothetical. And I really don't see myself settling down anytime soon. Like, right now, I honestly don't even see myself having kids. Haha. <laughs> Not having kids like ever? I'm with you. I mean, I don't know. I don't think so. I just want to be able to take life as it comes, I think. I'm with you. You just want to be wild and free? <laughs> Something like that. How about you after college? Do you want to settle down like right after? Definitely not. Taking life as it comes sounds pretty good. So, uh, taking life as it comes sounds pretty good. Indeed. Screw, something down. Screw kids especially. Cool beans. I'm so glad you think the same way I do. And if you move to New York, maybe we'll be roommates. Maybe more. Wow. I like that. It'd be a blast. It would be. Thanks for letting me talk about it. Whenever I talk about New York with Jeff, he always gets so upset. What, he wants to settle down or something? Yeah, I guess so. He doesn't want me to go far away. But I think he knows I'd go without him. The question must be asked. Don't take this the wrong way, but do you even like him? The question must be asked. Yeah, I do. He's going through a really tough time. He just wants to be a more serious couple. What do you mean by more serious? This is pretty personal, so you can't tell anyone, okay? Won't say a thing, swear to God. Me and Jeff haven't had sex. Oh, really? I think he wanted to try tonight or something. His parents aren't home. Hmm. I see. Is that why you didn't want to go over? Makes sense. Makes sense. I guess so. I'm just not ready for that with him. But it's okay. It's not like he's ever tried anything. It's just kind of annoying to keep turning him down. I mean, one and three are like, she knows. Just be careful, she knows. Wait until you're ready, she knows. You know, she doesn't need me to tell her, oh, just wait until you're ready. Like, it's like, well, yeah, no, duh. I've seen all those after school, I've seen all the same after school specials you have, all the special episodes of whatever TV shows. I'm sorry, that is isn't. It's okay to not want to. Yeah, 
Yeah, but sometimes I feel weird. Like I should have done it by now. Nah, screw that. Fuck shoulds. It's your life. Indeed. Don't boink anyone you don't feel like boinking until you're ready to boink. Thanks, James. If you don't mind me asking, have you had sex? Let's go with pure virginal. Boy. No, I haven't. Oh, cool. Then we're in the same boat. Haha. <laughs> that makes me feel a lot better. Thanks so much for talking with me about it. You're lucky I don't charge by the minute. Diffuse with diffuse the tension with humor. Seriously. Well, I guess I owe you. <laughs> I'm sorry I stole so much of your night just talking about random stuff. I mean, shit, that's... What else was I going to do, you know? Honestly, it's been nice. It is nice just shooting the shit with friends, you know? Yeah, it has been. I really like talking to you about stuff. I feel like we're different now, but in a good way. I feel like we're just really close friends now. I feel like we are too. Do you think we're like, I don't know. Do you think we're like best friends? I mean, alternative music is your favorite. We have the same outlook on life. And we both haven't had a serious relationship yet. So yeah, I'd call you my best friend. Yeah, BFFs! Best friends forever! Hell yeah, bitches! Best friend club! Yeah, I know. Let's give each other nicknames. What should mine be? Emmy. How about Emmy? Emmy? I like it. Like Emmy the Great. She's a singer. Do you want me to call you something besides James? Yeah, I guess. What'll it be? Jam. I mean, James is already like a one syllable word. It's, uh, you yeah, know, it's. It's not something you can really shorten, you know? So let's go, but yeah, let's go with jam. It suits you, I like it. Oh man, I think I need to get off the computer now. Is it bedtime? Nah, my mom needs to look at emails or something. You need your own computer. I didn't have my own computer until I moved out on my own. <laughs> I know, I do. Thanks again for everything tonight. Hey, anytime. I'll talk to you again soon, okay? Talk to you later. By Emmers. And there's Evelyn back. Back. Duh, it's Friday the 13th. Well, happy Friday the 13th.
Man, she was gone for a while. What are you going to do to celebrate? Definitely some black magic. You? Yo, same! I'm so happy it's fall. It's like my favorite season. Indeed, it's, uh... You know, starting to get a little bit cooler. You know, it's not as hot as uh, summer was. Not as cold as winter gets, but it's, you know, it's nice jacket weather. Hey, it's mine too. At least traditionally. Seasons have gotten freaking weird lately. Past few years. Freaking global warming has made seasons just wild. I'm recording this. It's December 21st when I'm recording this. And there's, like, there's no snow. So, like, southern and southern uh, Ontario, eastern Ontario. We're getting, it's looking like it's going to be a green Christmas. Apparently that's, like, El Nino stuff going on, so. But even then, it's, like, it's really weird that there's just nothing. And snow does seem to come later every year. And still sticks around long enough. Are you going to dress up for Halloween? I hadn't thought about it. Are you? Yeah, I am. Jackie's having a big Halloween party. I'm looking at costumes now. What do you think I should go as? Which sexy nurse? How about Alice in Wonderland? How about Alice in Wonderland? Sexy Alice in Wonderland. Whoa, no way! I was actually trying to decide between Alice in Wonderland and Sally from Nightmare Before Christmas. Which do you think is better? Alright, so here's the Alice in Wonderland costumes. Eh, kinda cute. Sexy Alice. Also Sexy Alice. Broken image. Hard to tell if that's broken just like... Because the game came out in 2017 and the link is just gone now. Or if uh, it's... like, Or if it was broken to begin with as like... Because sometimes they would be. So yeah, that's those are the the Alice costumes, and Sally. Very nice uh, work on that one. Really good makeup there.
Um, so, which do you think is better? I'm gonna say Sally. I think I like the Sally costume the most. That's what I was thinking. I'll go pick it up tomorrow. Jackie's parties are always crazy. You can probably expect more drunk texts from me. Hey, I'm okay. down. Just try to smell better this time. What's the point of that? I think I still have some of those locked on my phone from this summer. I don't know how you understood any of them. You know, I'm just that good. Well, I'll like this one. OMG, we fix Jackie's roof thigh now and starts nerve fluted so beautiful. Stars never looked so beautiful. You got it! Damn, I'm impressed. I wouldn't have guessed I wouldn't have guessed that. Hey, maybe you could just come to the party. Do you drink? Sometimes, yeah. Not too much. Same here! What's your favorite? Probably just beer. Yep. Beer's my favorite, too! We should totally get together. And make out. Would you want to come to the party? Yeah, maybe? We'll see. Yeah, we should both totally uh, just make out. The only rule is you have to dress up. What would you go as? And if you're going as Sally... Maybe I'll go as Jack Skellington or something. If you're going as Sally, I'll be your Jack. We can bone. I'm sorry. Inappropriate. That'd be awesome, Sauce. We'll take some pictures together. I'll add you to the event page. Oh, wait. Are we friends on Facebook? No, but we should be. Then friend me when you get a chance, yo. And yep, here we go. Now we can see her, uh... So, add as friend. Poke. Her birthday is April 12th. So I think she and Emily are... Emily was April 18th, wasn't she? So yeah, just a few days away from each other. Uh, Jackie mentioned Evelyn and her note. Thrift shop in the ledger of our most recent haul. Plans to attend Halloween party. Rocking out to punk music. Uh, against me, don't lose touch. Uh, hanging with friends, concerts, being unpredictable. Senses Fail, Rise Against, No Effects, Against Me, Taking Back Sunday, Motion City Soundtrack, Anti Flag, Blink 182, Less Than Jake, Don't Like Any of Them, Final Destination 3, 28 Days Later, Corpse Bride, Nightmare Before Christmas, Sin City, 
did like uh, Sin City and uh, Nightmare Before Christmas is good as well. Dexter, Fear Factor, Daily Show. Loved the Daily Show back then. Extremely loud and incredibly close. Alice in Wonderland, Harry Potter, of course. Every person loved Harry Potter. I'm like the only person on the planet who's never read Harry Potter. And I never will. You're entirely bonkers, but I'll tell you a secret. All the best people are. Uh, Pen Cuts Anonymous, Tim Burton, Warp Tour, B Movies, Room Raiders, OMG Cute Kittens. This obviously, yeah, against me. Survey. Are you prepared to tell the whole truth and nothing but the truth? Sure, dude. Think of your last ten kisses. Who were they with the same person? Who counts kisses? Who was the last person you shared a blanket with? Probs, Jackie. Did anyone see you kiss the last person you kissed? I don't think so. Who was the last person to call you? Jackie again. How are you feeling? Swell. How does your hair look? Ugh, gross. I haven't showered yet. Would you ever try being a vegetarian? Yes, sir. I am one. Oh. Alright. Yeah, we can't date anymore. No dating. I, uh, I need... I need my dead animals. I need my meat. What do you carry with you at all times? Uh, my purse, which has my wallet, iPod, cell phone, a lighter, and usually cigarettes. Ugh, oh, and she's a smoker? Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to date her anymore. Smoker and a vegetarian? Have you ever gone out of your way to make someone happy? Yes, what kind of question is that? Any plans for summer? That's so far away. Do you believe teenagers can fall in love? I did. Will you be in a relationship next month? I don't know. Does sex mean love? Nope. What are you doing for your next birthday? I'm not sure yet. What are you wearing on your feet? Nothing. They are bare-ass naked. Woo! What are your plans for tomorrow? Probably hang out with whoever. How old are your siblings, if you have any? 23 and 31, or something like that. Something like that. Is your birthday in less than six months? Uh, yeah, barely. Would you rather get stuck on an island with your ex or a python? Ex? Do you get upset over the opposite sex easily? No more le easily than ones of the same sex. Ooh, we got a bicon on our hands? Could be, could be. We could have ourselves a bicon. Are you ticklish? Sure thing. What who woke you up this morning? The alarm on my phone. Honestly, do you hate the last girl you were talking to? Honestly, no. Were you happier now or three months ago? Now, I guess. Are you a couple with the last person you kissed on the lips? Not anymore. Have you ever walked on the beach at night? Sure I have. Last place you fell asleep other than your bed. Probably Jackie's bed, but I don't know. Do you think making out is slutty? Well, in public, oh, yeah. Yeah, no, it's not. It's fine. Do you think things will change in the next few months? Yuppers. Is the last person you texted single? Yeah, she is. Who is it? Jackie. Favorite color? Today, probably cyan. When will your next kiss be? I don't know. Give me a call and we can arrange it. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. What song are you listening to? Calling Cars by Senses Fail. How late do you normally stay up on weekdays? Way, way later than I should. Yeah, I hear that. Sleep procrastination. Woo, woo. When do you prefer to take a shower? In the morning or night? Death at night. Can you watch scary movies? I can, they're my favorite. Do you want any piercings? Yeah, I do. And a tattoo. Would you rather stay at home or be out and about? Out and about almost always. 
What color should we wear? Purple with bright yellow. Is there someone who knows everything or almost everything about you? Yeah, you bet. Uh, let's check out Steve. Relationship status is complicated. Crusher's Metal Apocalypse Music Festival. Disturbed 10,000 Fist. Uh, metal, new experience, skipping school, drinking. Megadeth, I used to really like Megadeth back in the day. Slipknot, Disturbed, Mastodon, Slayer, Corn, System of a Down, Stone Sour, Raw Machine. Cool, cool. Avenged Sevenfold. Favorite movies? Most movies are shit. I find the celebrity culture in this country so stupid. TV shows? See above. Ooh. You're so cool. Favorite books? The Art of War, The Anarchist Cookbook. Ooh, how edgy. You're so edgy and cool. People have only as much liberty as they have the intelligence to want and the courage to take. Fake ID hoster holders. Oh, right, yeah, Steve. I totally forgot. Steve was Evelyn's friend with the fake ID. Anarchist United, Metalheads, YPMND, Life is Overrated. Evelyn, but Steve seems like a douche, honestly. I don't like Steve. I read your survey note. I just read your survey note thing. Oh no! Hey, you know my darkest secrets. So what are you up to? I know I do black magic. Oh shit, that's right. What sort of black magic? Just catching up with the devil. What are you up to? You're the devil. Just listening to music. Since the scale kit just came out with a new album. Oh really, is it any good? It's all the good. Link goes specifically to uh, still searching. Or more accurately, it goes straight to uh, it goes to can't be saved. The song can't be saved. This song and the next one are my favorite. I don't like it. I don't. I. I. I don't like sense of smell. They're not my thing. I'm sorry. They're just not my thing. But for the sake of flirting with a cute girl, this is really good. I'm so glad you like the same music as me. Seriously, you're pretty swell. Actually, like it. I'm lying. You're pretty swell too. I'm just pretending. I really like talking to you. Yeah, I'm glad we're friends. I'm really glad we sat next to each other in history last year. Although I feel like there's a lot about you I still don't know. 
Hey, you haven't opened a book. Me too. I have an idea. Let's play a game. I get to ask a question about whatever. Then you get to ask a question. That sounds fun. I just ask what comes to mind first. If you, if you take too long, long it'll, it'll just be my turn again. again. Are, you Are you ready? ready? As, as ready as I'll ever be. I'll, I'll start, start with an easy, easy one. Do you, Do you remember, remember my, my favorite, favorite kind of movie? movie? It, it was horror, right? right? Yep, yep, yep. I, I knew you'd remember. Now, now it's your turn. turn. Quick, ask, ask me anything. anything. Hmm, what's, what's your, your favorite, favorite animal? animal? Cats! Cats. Kids, Kids are, are pretty much the cutest thing ever. ever. I, love I love cats. cats. Let's, Let's see. Have, have you ever snuck, snuck out of your house? house? Never, Never had. had. Nope, my, my parents would kill me if I did that. that. I, I never had to speak it up. Like, like, I'm, like, if, if I needed to go up, my mom would have been fine. Like, like, yeah. Hey, I'm, I'm going to go... I'm going, going out for a bit. I'm going to go hang out with this, this person. person. Okay. okay. Yeah, like, like yeah. yeah. I don't, I don't know. I was, I was, I was, I was a good kid. kid. I was a good, good kid. kid. I was well-behaved. And, and like, like responsible, and I don't, I don't know, know, I wasn't doing, doing anything dangerous. Anything. Just... So, yeah, so, yeah I, I never had to sneak, sneak out. out. I, mean, I was... didn't really have anywhere, anywhere to, to go. go. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, I, I definitely, definitely understand, understand that. that. Your turn again. again. Yeah. Have, Have you ever, ever done, done any drugs? drugs? Get, Get serious, serious questions. questions Just weed, weed, but I kind of like the idea of experimenting. experimenting. Alright, All right. let's, let's get, get serious. serious. Do you have, Do you have a crush, crush on anyone? anyone? Two. Two. Yeah, yeah, I, I totally, totally do. do. I got, I got two, two crushes. crushes. Oh, scandalous. I wonder, I wonder who it is. is. I know, I know what, what I'm asking, asking next. next. Have you ever been, been in love? love? And, and if, if yes, yes, with whom? First, first of all, with, with whom? Unfair, that's, that's like two questions, two questions in one. one. For the record, it would be with whom? whom? Oh, please, please, it's, it's one, one and a half, half at most. You're, You're a cheater, but I'll answer both. both. I, guess I guess it's, it's kind, kind of a long, long story. story. I got, I got all, all the time in the world. world. I, got I got all the time in the world. world. Steve, Steve Myers, Myers, you know, you know him, right? right? Is that, Is that the fake, fake ID, ID guy? guy? Yeah, yeah, me and him dated for a lot of my sophomore and junior year. year. It, got it got pretty serious, serious and I definitely, definitely think I loved him. I think he was, was going out to college, so he broke up with me last winter. winter. I'm, I'm sorry, sorry, that sucks. That sucks. Oh, it's okay. okay. It's more confusing, confusing than anything. anything. Like, like, I'm, I'm getting, getting over it. It's, it's just weird. weird. Are you, like, off and on? Nah, definitely not. It's 
just that the feelings still hang around. When it worked, we were a really good couple. Was he your first boyfriend? Boyfriend. Evelyn and Steve kissing in a tree. You're sitting in a tree. I mean, yeah, my first real boyfriend. Like, he was the first person I ever had sex with. Do you have any feelings for other people? I mean, I had like a fling this past summer, but nothing as serious as Steve, obviously. A fling with whom? Brian, I don't think you know him. We fooled around, but like, it was fun, not serious, you know? James, if you don't mind me asking, have you ever had sex? No, I haven't. Gotta be honest. Oh, okay. Well, can you still understand what I mean? Yeah, lust versus love and all that. Not a lot of people know, but me and Steve had these plans for our future. So being together felt like a big deal. What kind of plants? It's gonna sound really stupid. Don't judge me, okay? Come on, Evelyn. No judgment here. So I thought we'd go to the same college together. And then maybe, I don't know, get married, start a family, whatever. That sounds normal. It's not wrong to want something. It does sound normal. Sounds painfully normal. Boringly normal. Just feels silly now thinking about it. But I think that's why it's been hard to get over the breakup. You know, that future doesn't need Steve. Fair point. I know, and I still want that future even without Steve. But maybe that's silly. You have so much time, that future is still definitely in reach. I just think people think it's stupid when I talk about it. Well, fuck those people. You can do whatever you want. Fair point. Thanks, James. You really made me feel a lot better. What are your plans after college? Do you want a family? No, I don't think so. I kind of want to be free to do whatever I, whatever for a while. Oh cool, yeah I feel like a lot of people feel that way. Hey, I just remembered, it's still my turn to ask you a question. You know, kind of a shame, you know, like... Yeah, there's the four of us. There's me, Evelyn, Emily, and Jeff. And like, Jeff wants to settle down and start a family. Or so like, yeah, so Emily, like, so Emily's dating Jeff. Emily doesn't want to settle down and have a family. Jeff does. And then there's me and Evelyn, who are both single. We could hook up, except, you know, she wants to settle down and start a family, and I don't. 
So we got it backwards. You know, I should be dating Emily, and Evelyn should be dating Jeff. So that Evelyn and Jeff can have their family together, and me and Emily can... Do whatever the hell we want. Well, okay, sure. Oh, here's a good one. Would you ever date someone like me? Kind of a loaded question there. And a tough one. It's not an easy question. Would I date someone like her? Yeah, definitely. You're pretty swell. Oh, you're swell too. Your turn. Last question. Don't fuck it up. Do you want, uh, are you getting tired? Yo, what were you going to say? I saw you delete some shit. I was, I don't, I was asking the same question as you. Would you date someone like you? We both like to party. But you haven't been in a serious relationship yet. And we want different things in life. So, I don't know. Maybe? You're a really good friend, and I don't want to lose that. Hey, thanks. Oh, wow, it's getting late, huh? And I still want to shower before bed. Hey, you do you. In, you do you. In the shower. I'm a do me. In the shower. I'm gonna go, but tonight was really fun. We should do this again. Good night, James. Good night, Evelyn. I sense there's something in the wind that feels like tragedies at hand. Sally. Can now sign out. So yeah, chapter two is long. Chapter two is real long. To be fair, a lot of that is just because of uh, looking at like the face notes and stuff. But even aside from that, nah, it is, it's long. It's a long ass, uh, chapter. There's a lot in it. Um, and yeah, some pretty interesting stuff in it I would say interesting ways in which the relationships develop a little bit between the two or with the two Definitely some flirting going on between me and Evelyn. Not so much me and Emily, but... Yo, we both, like, me and Emily have a lot in common. Which does make it seem like, you know, we'd be a... We might be a pretty good couple.
definitely pretty sure that me and uh, me and Evelyn would not be a good couple. We wouldn't really work out. We want different things. Um, so yeah, that'll do for this episode. So join me next time for chapter three. See you then.